certainly had hot weather for the start of the state fair today, but you didn't hear a lot of folks complaining about it. KCCI Cynthia Fodor is out there too. She joins us live from the fairgrounds. You all right out there, Cynthia? <laughs> I'm not complaining. I'm so happy to be here, you guys, especially after missing last year, as I think are most people here. And you know, you'll find quite a few things that are new and different on the fairgrounds this year, but it's the old traditions that keep bringing people back again every year. Like most fairgoers, Sean Haley has mapped out a plan on the first day of the fair. Absolutely, you always have to get corn dog. It's his baby daughter's very first fair. How fun is that to have her along? Oh, it's great, except she's passed out already. For most families, it's about finding old favorites. We walked into the uh, ag building here and I saw that the butter cow was up and so I took a picture of it and then I said out loud, check because if you're gonna visit the Iowa State Fair, that's one of the things that you have to see. And checking out all that's new, like this year's feature sculpture crafted out of butter. There's always a cow, but the things around the cow sometimes are different, and I was really taken by the butter slide. I thought it was just neat as me. Not far from the new 4-H building, many are finding the new craft beer tent is the hot spot to cool off. How many beers on tap here? We have 86 beers on tap. We'll go through 168 different beers throughout the fairground. And we spotted the governor racing across the fairgrounds. We just did the weigh-in for the ram. We're going to grab a pork belly on a stick, and then we're going to go back and do the weigh-in for the big boar. <laughs> and it's, I don't think it's even noon. There's no place like the Iowa State Fair to celebrate all things Iowa. I was raised in a family here in Des Moines that always believed in coming to the fair to celebrate what's good and positive about Iowa, and I think that that's something worth upholding, and so I'm trying to pass that on to my kids because I think it's important. A great tradition to pass on to your kids, we all know that. And another tradition, if you walk around the fairgrounds tonight, you'll see free concerts going on at stages all around the fairgrounds. And we have an Iowa favorite right here tonight on the Mid-American stage, the Nottas getting ready to play here at 7 o'clock. Live at the Iowa State Fair, Cynthia Fodor, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.